This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hello, I'm Jeff Vaughn. Here's what's happening today around the Southland. A crazy scene from Palos Verdes. A driver somehow managed to fly off of a road and land on top of a house. This happened this afternoon on Palos Verdes Drive West. A firefighter say one person was hurt in that accident. Health officials say that there is only one confirmed case of Zika virus in LA County, but they say 10 to 20 others, including pregnant women, are now being tested for that virus. Zika is spread by mosquitoes and can be transmitted sexually. Health experts say to keep that bugs at bay, everyone should remove all standing water from homes and yards. SoCal Gas is facing a wrongful death lawsuit after a 79 year old Porter Ranch woman died. Zelda Rothman lived three miles from the Aliso Canyon gas leak. The family's attorney says Rothman had stage four lung cancer, but claims the gas leak hastened her death. SoCal Gas is not commenting on that lawsuit tonight. Well, the southbound 5 freeway in the Norwalk area will close later on this week so crews can work on the Rosecrans Avenue Bridge. The freeway will shut down from Friday midnight until 5 a.m. and Saturday from 1 a.m. to 6 a.m. For the latest on these stories and for news any time of the day, go to CBSLA.com. Hello, I'm CBS meteorologist Rich Fields. Nice day today. We're going to call it hazy sunshine for the most part. 64 for the daytime high, still four degrees below normal, but that's all going to change tomorrow. Satellite and radar showing some inclement weather off to our north San Francisco Bay Area northward. None of it did do to come down into the LA area at all. There's the satellite and radar for us locally. Just some very high wispy cirrus clouds. We do have some high surf advisories for about three counties around the area, including Ventura County for overnight tonight. Could see some local sets cresting 12 feet. Mostly clear tonight down town 45 for the overnight low. Here's your extended outlook for the next seven days. Still a wispy cirrus cloud here and there. 70 downtown tomorrow. 67 at the beaches, 69 for the valleys and IE. Everybody in the 70s through Saturday, 80s by Sunday. And look at this mid 80s for many areas by Tuesday of next week. That's a look at your forecast. Super Bowl 50 is just four days away and you can only watch the game on CBS 2. We'll of course have coverage all day long. Now here's a look at what's coming up tomorrow night at 11 o'clock on CBS 2 News. Thursday at 11, a local child care center and a convicted sex offender. Who would put them together in the same building? You a registered sex offender? Your state government did. That's unacceptable. <laughs> and your tax dollars are paying his salary. A convicted sex offender working within easy reach of unsuspecting children. A David Goldstein investigation, Thursday at 11 on CBS 2 News. And immediately following CBS 2 News at 11 o'clock, watch The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. Tonight's guests are Dr. Phil, actors and directors Jay and Mark Duplass, sociologist Michael Eric Dyson, and musical guests Anderson Pack and the Free Nationals. Watch The Late Show with Stephen Colbert tonight, 1135 on CBS 2. And that is your CBSLA.com news brief. CBSLA.com is where we are always on. Click Listen Live to hear KNX News Radio and our other stations anywhere you are.